Welcome back to the Walleye Now presentation of the month brought to you by Target Walleye, where we break down some of the best presentations happening right now all across walleye country. And today we're gonna to tell you talking about lead core. I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's just a little touch of fall in the air. Cool at nights, warm in the day, one of the best times you can be fishing this presentation. And if you guys are excited about fall, jump on over to the Walleye Now app available on Google Play in the App Store, where we have an absolute mountain of fall walleye fishing content available for you to put you, the angler, on the fast track to walleye fishing success. But stay tuned, we're gonna do a quick little breakdown here on one of my favorite late summer into fall presentations, which is walleyes on lead core. Oh, right there, right there you guys, fish on. Right off the bat, wow, look at that. All right, there we go. That did not take long at all. You know, it's feeling like an all right fish here. And this is the time of year where I seem, I always find myself, oh, well, no way. Oh, I thought we might have had two on for a second. <laughs> but this is the time of year, just kind of late August into September. And then all the way kind of till turnover where I find myself fishing a lot of lead core. But realistically, it's a presentation that works anytime you might have fish in a little bit deeper water. And this is a lot of times time of year where you're finding fish in a little bit deeper water. And today we're sitting out here just fishing a big 26 foot flat and pulling lead core down it. Here's our first one kind of of the afternoon here. Out this morning, film some awesome YouTube comment content and uh, figured we better come back out and give you guys the lowdown on one of this, one of these kind of top presentations you could be fishing right now. Come here, buddy. We'll keep you coming in, keep you coming in. Probably just gonna go ahead and net them real quick. Right up along the side of the boat here. Play nice at the net, buddy. Just a nice, you know, 19 incher. There we go. Well, that did not take long at all. We'll take them that size all afternoon. There we go. Look at that guy right there. Beautiful walleye. Early fall, late summer, whatever you want to call it, pulling lead core, fantastic way to come out and put a bunch of these fish in the boat. Almost no matter where you're going to go, from Lake Erie all the way out to, you know, North Dakota, South Dakota, and your western reservoirs. All right, so first things first, what is lead core and what makes it special? Well, essentially, it's a, it's a braided sheath around a lead line. And that lead line is meant to achieve depth. So you can put on whatever bait you want and achieve depth just with the line. Now, what kind of lead core is generally my favorite or generally you know the most productive way to fish? I love suffixed 832 advanced lead core. I'm always fishing it in either a 12 pound or an 18 pound. Put the same thing on all your reels so you get a similar dive curve. Now, this is obviously, it's gonna change colors like every 30 feet or something like that. I prefer to use a line counter as a lot of times it's more exact. So you don't have, you'll hear a lot of times, oh, catching fish on four colors, catching fish on three colors, whatever it is. It's obviously colors. As I let line out, you know, you're gonna see that change. Obviously with a line counter, you can get very specific on as far down as you have to go. Now, it's very simple to achieve depth on this. The more line I let out, the deeper down my bait goes. We're trolling a 26 foot flat today. So if I drop this out to 150, I'm just smashing the bottom of the lake right now. Essentially what I wanna do is those fish are on the bottom to a foot up. I wanna reel in till I'm not hitting bottom. So you can reel in a little bit of line, say, you can see it on your rod tip, dunk, 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 dunk. Okay, bait's still hitting bottom. Gotta reel in a little bit more line. Reel it into about 110 feet. Okay, I'm not hitting bottom. I now know my bait's right in that strike zone. So don't be worried so much about how much line achieves this, how much line achieves that. Go out to where you're seeing fish, drop your bait back, see when it's hitting bottom, reel it in a little bit more either so it's just once in a while hitting or just barely not hitting and you're right there in the zone where those fish are. Now, there's about 97 different kinds of baits in which you can pull on lead core. You can pull small shad bodied baits. You can pull longer like banana style baits. You can pull shallow running suspending baits that you can only get down four or five feet. That's kind of the beauty of lead core is that you can put a bait as far down or right where you have to to catch those fish. It doesn't matter how deep that bait dives. And one big tip I would throw out there is, you know, a lot of these lakes where you're starting to see a lot of pressure where maybe before you could take a bait um, like a big banana style diving lure big bait that can get down in that 28, 20, 30 foot zone, big presentation. Where you used to be able to go out and long line those baits, either on planer boards or down or off the side of the boat, and send it back there 
a buck 50 and catch fish a lot of times fish get so present or so kind of pressured on these big presentations one of the best things about lead core is you could take these smaller maybe it's a, a smaller shad bodied bait and you could stick it down there in that zone and they have not seen this stuff before so it's super effective a lot of times to put small baits down in deeper water and this time of year this late summer into the fall you have a lot of fish either in transition in deeper water going from a basin over here to a basin over here following a hard to soft bottom transition and a presentation like lead court where you control around at generally two miles an hour to two two and a half miles an hour cover a ton of these big transition areas and get your bait around fish this is one reason that lead core is such a productive way to fish this time of year hopefully you guys enjoyed this walleye now presentation of the month brought to you by target walleye Lead core is a phenomenal way to fish this time of year and hopefully this kind of pointed you guys in the right direction or at least to get started on it. If you guys like videos like this, these highly informational walleye fishing videos, maybe it's on a presentation, maybe it's on a location, make sure you get on the Walleye Now app which is available on Google Play in the App Store where we have thousands and thousands of hours of content just like this meant to put you, the walleye angler, on the fast track to walleye fishing success. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Stay tuned for the next one. We'll see you guys later.